Hello everybody, it's Susan here. I am going to do a flip cup today. Um, I haven't done one in a long time, so it could be a little rusty. Um, okay. Yes, so I might be a little rusty. Um, this is a, it's a 13 ounce cup going to use about this much which I think is around maybe five ounces something like that this is an 8 by 10 just canvas board um, it probably will warp after I'm done after it's dried and what you do when they warp is once it's totally dry you leave it for quite a few days I think um, just to make sure that it's not sticky anymore. So probably about a week, let it dry for. Then turn it over, spray the back with a little bit of water, not much, and rub it in like this. And then lay it, um, so let's say on plastic or somewhere, somewhere safe. And then put something heavy on top until it dries, probably just the day. And it should come out really flat. So, the colors I'm using are a brilliant, brilliant red, white, uh, pale yellow, and this is, uh, there's this is a phthalo turquoise, and then I have Prussian blue. Consistency is, um, it doesn't disappear in, in the uh, cup. It just kind of, it, I mean, it doesn't sink in, I should say. Um, it just sort of makes a tiny little bit of a mound, and then it just disappears. Maybe this one will be better to show you. No, I don't think so. It could be. I don't know. The light in here. Uh, try red. Oops. It's kind of hard to show the consistency from above. Hopefully that you get that. Okay. Um, I'm going to put white in the bottom. I've mixed my paints. Some of them are leftovers, like this one here is leftover, and I can't remember what I added to it. Probably um, Floetrol. This as well. I'm not really sure. Um, I use either Floetrol or pouring medium to mix, and I don't use that much. I'm depends on the thickness of the paint. I, I could use one to one. If it's a little bit thinner, then I'll use less. And these two, I used Floetrol in them, and I didn't use one-to-one. -one. I used a little bit less of the Floetrol, and I added water. So I'm going to add white in the bottom. There's something in the cup. mark. So I'm just going to put some in the bottom. Oh, it looks like a, the white is a bit runny but that's okay. And I'm going to go red next. I'm going to go yellow next. A bit of white in there so I think I have enough white the turquoise the phthalo blue pouring it for 
from up high too so it kind of sinks in that's not enough paint more red well maybe I'll put some white in between I don't want it to be too dark but more red more yellow That's it for the yellow. for the blues. I think that might be enough. It's actually probably not even five. It's probably about four ounces, maybe three. Okay, so here goes nothing. how to do it. The, the, oh, no, wrong slide. Oh my god, I almost made a mistake. <laughs> Alright, so just flip it over. Pop some bubbles. Just to make things a little more interesting, I added some bare satin enamel just to the white. Not much, just maybe, you know, I don't know, a few drizzles in the white just to see what would happen. I'm curious what would happen. looking pretty cool already. I almost don't want to move it. So what I'll do, I'm going to move that away. I'm just going to move it slow. I don't want to ruin the, I don't want to ruin the cells. So I'm just going to go slow in a circle. Wow, look at these ones. Oh my goodness. I have to take a picture of this. And then I will, just in case I lose it. So I'm going to come right back. I'm back. It's very cool. I love this color here. I love the turquoise.
color is so nice right here. Look at this. Just gonna let it run off a bit so I have the edge. I really like it. It's so pretty. It's so cool. Okay, that's good there. So now I'm going back. Looks like I'm losing those cells no matter what I do. pretty cool. Just got to move it down this way a bit. Okay. Making sure that I like that. I like what's happening all in here. Hmm. I'll just torch it again. Just let it sit. See if it changes. see on these colors here that much. I wonder if I should move everything over. And it looked pretty cool at the beginning, but I'm not even sure I like it now. But I just like I like this part right here. And there's too much, too much of this other color going on. Pop some more air bubbles. And get some other stuff going on here. It's not much happening on this side.
Okay, I've decided I'm going to balloon smash. This is way too busy. And if it doesn't look any good, I will um, wipe it off. Paper towels out. using my old balloon that I've kept for a while. It's pretty soft. Okay, so where should I go? Where should I go? Oh, that looks nice. Nice color. Hi, baby. Oh, Chelsea. It's okay. My dog, again, does not like me painting. I'm going to do one. Oh, I don't want it to be. Here, about like this. Uh, I don't think this is turning out. That looks cool, but the rest of it doesn't look cool. 